go crazy in the sense of like the game or whatever like do you typically look at yourself or look at it best as like you be independent or signed I get that a lot um is it situation with the with the sign and shit it just like it gotta make sense you know what I mean and I gotta have leverage in the contract so uh I'm gonna stay independent until I'm able to build that leverage and I read I'm not worried about if it take like 10 years or 15 because I know at the end of the day shit I won and I got what I earned when I work for and I deserve besides me selling short and being fucked for 15 years you feel me so like shit if the money gonna keep coming independent shit I'm gonna just take all the connection and the knowledge I know and push what I got going right. until that contract makes sense so you would rather build your own label and shit, build that's your what I'm, I already got that going so far. Right. Like, you know what I mean? So, like, I have my own label for, like, a year and a half. I've been independent. I've been funding my own shit. So, mm-hmm. everything, like, I've been doing, I always look at it, like, the day I sign, it got to be double of what I spent. Right. So, to where I know one thing, like, I'm not about to sign for something that I've already invested in myself just to get back the same money. Mm-hmm. You feel me? Because at the end of the day, I'm back at the, fuck, the starting point. Right. But it got to make sense. You know what I mean? Getting signed is like a credit card. Shit, right. I look at it like this. It's shit. like a credit card you to me. I tell them, grab you a shovel old. and dig a hole. And just put a bag of money in it. Right. You grab it, you're in a hole already. You feel me? So right. that's how I look at it every time. Like, it don't matter how deep. I look at it like this. The bigger the bag, the deeper the hole. Nah, that's facts. You feel the me? bigger the credit card limit. You know what you I'm saying? Mean? I look at being signed like a credit card. But like I look at it like P, I you think yeah, hell yeah, you and I think somebody. people don't recognize that shit, bro, until like they didn't blow all their money or whatever. They be so blinded by them just walking up a chain of watch and the money right there and shit they not used to. So yeah, I'm gonna sign why I sign that. They don't know what right. they even sign. You see? Know I mean? So like I just be looking at that shit like man, you gotta take care of business first. They won't have fun. So like, um, did Gates give you any advice on that type of stuff, or what did y'all talk about? Shit, I ain't gonna lie, that's big brother. But um, shit, with anything with business, he always tell me like, man, paperwork. You feel me? Like he always preach paperwork. You know what I mean? And like, I always listen to him. Like coming from where I come from, and he come from the same background. But by me being younger and him learning the game already, it's more of me listening to him. To where it's like, shit, I doubt if he gonna leave me wrong. You know what I'm saying? So, like, the shit that he actually be saying, it really be real knowledge. And he be guiding me on the way up. To where, like, he always say, like, man, you take a show. I don't care how much it is. Don't take cash. Make sure it's on the contract because anything can happen. Like, you two of us, you don't come anything. A lawsuit next. You feel me? So, like, he like, before you take a loss, make sure you cover. Like, use that as insurance. So, like, he always teach me the game, dog. Like, with anything. That's some so, shit what moguls do you look up to? Shit, I'm gonna be honest. Uh, I really don't have nobody I look up to, but like, shit, as like help. Yeah, I have some people that be, you know, helping me along the way, like with certain things. Like I could reach out here for some hit here and get advice here, but I don't have this one specific person that really just, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Cause like, shit, when I look in the mirror, shit, I look at like who did everything for me, who put me where I'm at, and it was me. Right. So like, shit, who could I look up to that put me where I'm at? Nobody. Exactly. So that's why I said I really don't have one person. Let me ask you a question for the, for the listeners What's and for on? myself also. What did DB stand for? Shit, that shit stand for different breed, dream big. Like the dream big, my homie has started this clothing line, and like he in jail right now. But anyways, he started a clothing line named Dream Big, and I asked him what it was standing for, and he was like, "Man, we're in a small city, everybody has small dreams." But he was like, "Shit, I ain't gonna lie, cause he like one day I just want to own this bitch." I'm like, "You want to own the city?" So he, I'm like, damn, some big ass dream. Yeah, so that's why I ain't gonna lie. Right. That's what I told him. I ain't gonna lie. He told me that, and I'm like, damn, bro. But that shit really means something because, like, us being childhood friends and growing up like from real babies, and him saying that, and I know what he didn't went through, and you know what I mean. And for him to still see that, that tell me like, dog, like shit, shit things possible. That's some real shit. Just cause he ain't been no man. His hat I got on right now. <laughs> my dog, he locked up. He, he got yeah. his own clothing line. The clothing line is called Brand Our Culture. 
So y'all ever see me with this little hat on in the episodes <laughs> or whatever? That's Real my dog tight, be locked man. up. He coming home soon. You know that what they always yeah, say. Yeah, he be home my soon. My dog be, be home, home soon. soon right? Right? <laughs> Real talk. All the boys say that. Huh? <laughs> yeah, yeah, he be home soon. Yeah, soon. Yeah. Soon. Real till we see him, huh? Yeah. We we gonna be home. Real till we see him. If it ain't life. He be home he be soon. Home soon. Real time, I mean, real look, short. BG just got out. Yeah, they best right. saying he be home soon. He home hey, now. He, he home. Sex. He <laughs> be home. He 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 Independent. The shit that niggas that don't really want to talk about. They it. making more M's than the niggas in the main spot. Shit, like I ain't gonna lie, not to cut you off, dog. That's one dude I give, like I tilt yeah. my hat to, bro. Because like, like I ain't gonna lie, like I got a partner that he be trying to learn the industry shit, but he look at the media so much yeah. to where he don't really know and he lost. But yeah. we have arguments and you know the base going back and forth. You feel me? It's like, like, bro. Yeah, so like I told him like like dog, I be trying to get him to understand just cause you see them do with all them calls, chain that's not that theirs, bro. Rent it sometimes. So I tell him right here, like like, you know what I'm saying? Like I don't be wanna say all his names, but they got certain niggas like, bro, you can see situations happen and look at how they just change. Yeah. Like, not the kind of prison pockets, like, bro, everybody popped their gun was at the top, dog. Yeah. Nice. But nice. if you slowly notice notice, bro, you can look at all that shit just vanishing. Because, like, you could pay attention, like the cars, the jewelry, the lifestyle, the respect, the money, you only everything gone moment. away. You feel me? And it's like it take one incident to yeah, knock all that shit away. Right. He don't even like. I ain't gonna lie. Like I look at him, bro. He don't even look healthy no more. Yeah. You feel me? Like you could tell he's so he just nervous or everything. Yeah. And like, bro, like, you know, like all that shit just pull too. Like it's just the net, bro. People just be lost. 